Hey, hey. <clears throat> knock, knock. Who's there? <laughs> Your mom. <laughs> Dick hates me. Uh, Velka, in case you didn't recognize me. Ooh. I know, I kind of got caught in the rain. My hair is all wet in my face. Nah, I think I'd rather stay out here and, you know, see how much rain my clothes can still absorb. Catch a cold or two. Crack open a cold one. Okay, please. <laughs> please, can I come in? <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> it's even colder in here. <sighs> my hair is kind of wet, huh? Okay, quick, 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 quick. Don't even think about this question. Just look at me and answer. If I were an ugly, wet dog shivering in the rain, what breed would I be? Hey. Oh. Hey. That's mean. You're mean. But I would look exactly like that dog. Right. What am I doing here? And at this hour? <laughs> well, if you must know, I was coming back from Emily's. We just finished our papers. And I was walking by the neighborhood and I remembered that you were looking kind of off today. Kind of sad. No offense. Uh, <laughs> well, so, I, yeah, I started walking over to check on you. And the whole way I was just trying to think of a good reason to tell you that I was coming over. You know, like an excuse. <sighs> Well, not like that. Hey. Yeah, an excuse to see your weird face. Psh. Just kidding. I know, right? Sheesh. A, a beautiful girl insulting your ugly face marches on in, soaking wet from the rain and demands... Coffee? Can you please make me a hot cup of coffee? Please? I don't have any at home, and I'm cold. Whoa. You're right, I actually am shivering. Huh? Well, okay, originally I was just going to ask you for a cup because I ran out at my place, but now I'm asking you for one because I'm basically a Felka popsicle. <sighs> clothes? I don't have an extra set of clothes. But I guess I should go to- oh. Are these- Are these your clothes? Okay. <laughs> I'll go change in the bathroom. Okay. So, did you finish on time? Hey. Oh my god. You got no sleep last night, did you? You pulled an all nighter? Dude. Look at you. <laughs> I think you're the one who needs a coffee. Just look at you right now. Your posture is that of someone who wants more than anything. That plop their face first into pillow and stay there for like 10,000 hours. Yeah. Are you okay? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, way to dodge the question. Stick a towel in my hands. <sighs> what? Come again? No! You must be exhausted, and I know you're overworked and sleep-deprived. No, it, the answer is no, I'm sorry. You're not working tonight. I don't care. Look at the state you're in. And as a matter of fact, <laughs> sit down. Hey, I'm sorry, but I can't stand seeing you like this. <laughs> Get it? Can't stand because I pushed you down to sit. <laughs> I'm on fire today. 
<laughs> Oof, I'm so cold. Jesus. <sighs> and I get to wear your hoodie. Yes, but if I'm getting a blanket too, then I'm sorry, Booka, but you're going down with me. There's no way in hell that I'm letting you work tonight. Plus, it's late. No, 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 no. Don't get up. Hey. I'm serious. I'm worried about you. Please. For me. Don't worry tonight. Let's just hang out. And I can grab a taxi home. <laughs> what do you mean? No, I'm not. Totally. You think a little thunder is going to scare me? You think you could keep me here? Just because you know I'm scared of a little storm? Please let me stay. Up, 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 up. You're staying here too. Sorry, if you're keeping me here, so am I. What'd I just say? Let's just lay here until we fall asleep. I don't snore, I promise. Well, listen, you could write in the morning. I'll even help you. Okay? Okay. Buzz, to be frank, I can tell you have things on your mind. Things you want to talk about, but don't know how to. <laughs> it's okay. Can I start? Like getting stuff off my chest, I mean. Okay. So, Emily, I can feel her slipping, like our friendship. Like nothing bad happened or anything, but we're drifting apart, you know? This just happens with friends sometimes, I know, but. I just was hoping it'd be different this time. Um, it hurts. But, you know, that's just life. Can't do much about it. It is what it is, and it's all right. Yeah. I know. Well, were you actually opening up to me? <laughs> I'm just joking. I think you're right. I think you definitely... I would agree that you work so much that you don't let people in. And anyone in. <laughs> Have you ever stopped to think that I do want to see you more? Hang out? Spend more time together? <laughs> You know, but you always have your nose in the books. In Polish, we call you a kuyon. Kuyon. Someone with their nose in the books. <laughs> you know, or someone who's too busy studying to see. I guess I, I'm... <laughs> hey, stop that. Stop. Because you're a really cool person. So let people in to enjoy you. Let me in. I care about you. I saw that something was on your mind today. I care about you? Come on, you know that. Like, <laughs> come on. Well, I, I mean, I don't want to sound dramatic right now. But I really do feel like... You feel it too. When we hang out, when we're together, it's like we're just both here for each other. You notice when I'm not okay, and I do too. Simply put, 
and we just fit together in like puzzle pieces, you and I. <laughs> that got deep. <laughs> but, but I do mean it. I'm sorry, I just had to acknowledge the tension there. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. I feel like such a baby being scared of the thunder. <laughs> sorry. <sighs> it's, you know, with Emily? I mean, it's just that family is so far overseas, literally so far. I, you know, so I try to get close to people here, but it's hard. It can be hard to let people in. To let me in. <laughs> but um, maybe if it were easy, it wouldn't be so worth it. I'm, I'm worth it. Look at you being a big softie, a big ugly softie. Well, can hey, can you set an alarm for the morning? I I I, I want to keep talking, but I can't oversleep. Um, I want to keep talking about this about us. Um, but I just didn't want to forget to remind you to set an alarm. Sorry. You know how scared I am of big storms. Yeah, well, this is like super embarrassing, so I, I, you can't tell anybody. I know you won't, but please, please promise. Thank you, promise. Thank you. Thank you. I, you know how I'm scared of big storms, obviously. Well, aha. Uh, uh, this is like super embarrassing, but you know, but uh, yeah, I, I sing myself to sleep when it's, uh, when I'm nervous, <sighs> it helps me just to take my mind off of it and go somewhere else, somewhere nice. Can I, can I sing for us? <laughs> okay. <sighs> ha ha, I made you yawn. Good. Submit to the tiredness. I deserve sleep. You deserve rest. Okay. What should I sing? Let me think. Give your heart and soul to me, and my 
will always be la vie en rose. Oh, I'm glad I'm putting you to sleep. That's, that's really, really nice of you to say. <laughs> okay. Shall we? Ah, <laughs> uh, let me think. Hmm. <sighs> They say there is a war between the man and the woman. Ah, ah. I never felt like this before. My heart knew that I couldn't. Ah. And then you take me in. And everything in me begins to feel like I belong Like everybody needs a home And when I take your hand Like the world has never held a man I know I cannot heal the hurt But I will hold you here forever If I can if I can <laughs> And then I learn the truth How everything good in life seems to lead back to you And every single time I run into your arms I feel like I exist for love only for love, like I exist for love, only for love. I can't imagine how it is to be forbidden from loving. Cause when you walked into my life I could feel my life begin Like I was torn apart The minute I was only born And you're the other half The only thing that makes me whole I know it sounds like a lie But you really need to know we are leaning out for love, and we will lean for love forever. I know I love you so. And then I learn the truth. How everything, oh, the thunder. <laughs> How everything good in life. Thanks, thank you. How everything good in life seems to lead back to you And every single time I run into your apartment <laughs> I feel like I exist for love Only for love and when you say my name, 
like white horses on the waves. I think it feels the same as an ocean in my veins, and you'll be diving in like nothing is out of place, and we exist for love, only for love, <sighs> only for love, and I love you, I love you, I love you, and I love you, I love you, I love you. Sorry if I touch you in the night. I like to sleep with my arms like windmills. <laughs> That's what you get for calling me a chihuahua. <laughs> Stop. Good night. Dobrano. Thank you for letting me stay. Hello, everybody. Thank you for going on this journey with me. This is part one of three. So I hope to have you along on the ride with me on this three-part series. I look forward to see you, seeing you along on this voyage. And if you're still listening up until now, thank you so much for watching and liking and commenting. It really helps. And I love getting to talk with you all. Very briefly, I wanted to mention merch. Thank you to everybody who bought merch this month. So, see you in next week's video. Love you. Mean it.